Hi, thank you for tuning in and watching this brief video. As you can see, I'm here in my living room and in the background I have my television running. In this video, I'm going to show you how, as a content owner or publisher, you can earn extra cash from your users. With the Zappo TV SDK, we've made it very easy for your users to enjoy all of your photos, videos and music in your app straight on the television. To show you how the SDK operates, I have installed the Slideshow Plus application on my iPhone. So let's have a look what the user experience is like. As you can see, I have the Slideshow Plus application installed on my springboard. When the Slideshow Plus application is launched, the available slideshows are shown in a list. In the case of your application, this may be thumbnails of videos or photos. When the user selects a video to show, the video will start playing on the mobile device, as is normally the case. However, check out how in the right bottom an icon starts breathing. When the user selects the icon, a list of devices is shown. Now only users who have a compatible connected device will see the icon breathing and are able to go through this process. However, in the case that the user still wants more information, they can select the link and the user is told that a connected device was found on their network. The user is then given the opportunity to also play a test video on TV. They select the TV to play it on and as you can see in the background a demonstration video or a small test video is played. At the same time on the mobile device the user is asked whether the video played correctly. When the user says yes the process continues. The user is now being told that they can actually register their television so that from now on all of the photos and videos or music in the application can be played on their TV. When the users decide to continue, the in-app purchase process is initiated. Now in the case of the Slideshow Plus app, a charge of $1.99 is displayed. But this is totally up to you. You can charge your users whatever fee you like. When the user says, let's buy it, the standard in-app purchase process is initiated. A password is asked when needed. In this case, I've purchased another app just recently, so I did not have to enter it. Now that my device has been registered, you can see that in the background, my slideshow is playing. While the slideshow or the video from your application is playing, the user is able to control the volume but also the playout of the content. The user can increase the volume or, if so desired, pause the video and continue to play it whenever they like. When done or when they want to continue watching the video on the mobile device, all they have to do is close it, the video on the television stops playing and the mobile device continues to play the video. You have now seen how easy it is for your users to register their television and for you to earn extra money. I invite you to visit our website to sign up for the SDK which is easy to install and best of all, it's free. We at Zappo TV are looking forward to powering your application soon. Thank you for watching.